Our third way of expressing function is for plus a noun or a noun phrase. Here we have just one pattern, which is be plus for plus the noun or the noun phrase. A couple of examples here. An otoscope is for ear examination. Example two, a tourniquet is for compression of an artery or vein. So these are our three main ways of expressing functions. Now, one more way of expressing functions. It consists simply of making a direct statement of what the instrument or equipment does. We have a couple of examples here. A pulse oximeter provides instant blood oxygen or pulse readings. That's what it does, provide the instant readings. Example two, braces can help mobilize in unstable joints. That's one of the things that braces do. Let's now talk about expressing negative purpose with the verb prevent. Here also you have two patterns. The first one is prevent plus a noun plus from plus a verb in the ing form. As in these two examples, an injection stand is used to prevent the patient's arm from moving during blood sampling. Example two, a tourniquet can be used to prevent snake venom from spreading in the body. Just one function of the tourniquet. The second pattern is prevent plus noun or noun phrase. Two examples here that mean exactly the same as example two above. A tourniquet can be used for preventing spread of spre snake venom in the body or a tourniquet can be used to prevent spread of snake venom in the body. Example two in the first pattern and the two examples of the second patterns, the second pattern mean exactly the same. You just have different ways of saying the same thing. That concludes this language section of module four. I hope you found it useful. Enjoy the practice activities and I will see you next week for module five. Bye.